I'm live. Um, thanks for joining me. Uh, on the recent video, uh, I showed you how to erect four inch by four inch posts, how to concrete them into the ground. And I wanted to show you now, this, the sun is sort of reflecting off the camera, so I want to make sure that you get a good view of what we're actually doing here now. If I come back over here, if you look at the fence as a whole now, you'll be able to see that every 1.8 I have these four inch by four inch posts. And what I've actually done, I've introduced them into this side of the garden because there's trees and shrubs next door. So you're not gonna see the back end of the fence and they wanna get the full benefit on this side. But the reason I introduced the posts into a fence run on this occasion is because when you see a fence like this, it's very commercial and it's not ideal for a domestic situation. So what I've done, I've introduced the post as we go on and then I've alternated the feather edge boards on each panel, giving a very ornamental look. And then what I'll do is the four by four inch posts, I will cut the tops off those and I'll put a little finial and a cap on top of there and that'll make it look, look just a little bit more personalize it a little bit more then also what i'll actually do i'll be putting a four inch by one inch capping piece along the top on this occasion i don't have any derail available but it's so important that you put something to stop the water ingressing into the end grain now i'm going to come over here you'll be able to see on here now on here you'll be able to see the four inch by four inch post i've been using a four by two rail and i've got three of them one in the middle one at the top okay and what i make sure that the board itself is sat flat on top of the four inch by two inch okay so it's not going to twist when you have like six inches overhang you see all too often and also what i've actually got if we go down here be able to see through the bushes and the shrubs here this is when it's happening i've got a four inch by one inch rot board sat against the four by two halfway across you don't necessarily need two rails on the bottom normally people use three inch by two inch but i've used the four by two because i think it'll have a little bit more longevity but all in all when you look at the fence from here you can see the, how the alternating the boards the feather edge boards along there it looks very very different and it'll, it'll look a lot more attractive especially when you're down the roadside here so far better job in itself well look thank you for joining on uh, this live stream today really really appreciate it don't forget to subscribe or you can go to my website which is www.greentoplandscapes.co.uk or you can find us on facebook it's called landscape and survival with johnny boy check it out all the best have a great day bye